All right, we're here with Kevin Jelic, uh, the man who designed this beautiful piece of dart art. Uh, beautiful track, man. Thank you, thank you. Uh, very jumpy, super crossy. Uh, what, when you build a track like this, uh, what do you, as you're building it, do you make any plans or what do you try to do? I try to envision building a layout that's going to race real well, create good passing, be fun for the drivers to like drive and like feel like they're really uh, getting around the track and hustling the car. So I really try to make it as fun as possible, as racy as possible, and as like good in conditions as possible. Yeah, I mean the surface is hurling up nice. It's super grippy. It's not breaking up. Uh, I know, I know you have your secrets. A lot of people have been asking if you're sealing it or whatnot, but I'm telling everybody it's just compaction and water. No, it's a good old fashioned uh, sweat labor. Uh, we've been working hard. We do a lot of water press. We have the like the best track crew here in Chico. All the guys on the track crew, they understand the process. We got a good team. Um, we all work well together. And we all kind of like think for each other and we all really like make the track come together and really good and be like as best as possible. Mm -hmm. And we use uh, no sugar, no sealer, and basically get it as good as possible. Yeah. The aggregate seems pretty good too. It seems to be hurling together. It has a wide line. It's dusty, but it's still got a wide line. There's been no watering, no blowing off today. It's been, it's been, it's been great. Yeah, that's a sign of the good work, I think. Uh, when you got a track that you don't have to go out and maintenance it, it has a race crew. Now, the good thing about it is, like, you get the, the dust on the outside, so if you get off the line, it creates passing opportunities. So if I go out there and blow it every time, it's going to be just a super good track, and everyone's going to get around the track real good. But I like to, like, let it race. I let it groove normally, be a normal racetrack and create good passing opportunities and good racing opportunities for drivers. Yeah, I love how you incorporated the oval. That looks great. Uh, it's like, you know, a little bit of Daytona or Talladega. The pit lane has been a big discussion today, but it hasn't been too bad so far. Yeah, it's working out. Yeah. I'm not disappointed with it. Yeah, it slows people down. What was your decision to make the pit lane like that? So guys that wanted to do fuel mileage, it's going to be, I believe, a 60-minute main event. Mm -hmm. So guys that are going 10 minutes have a possibility to take advantage of that fuel mileage and get that a reward for their hard work and tuning. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, we look forward. Thank you for all your hard work. You guys have done an excellent job. And uh, we look forward to seeing how it develops over the weekend. Yeah, thanks, guys.